What up guys, CCS Cody here, and today we're gonna to do another five minute video. That's how I've condensed all my videos down for you. So it's straight to the point on how to do something very specific. We've done retro gaming, we've done literally Fire Stick user guide setup 101, and now we're gonna do something which uh, a lot of you have problems with, and that's actually cleaning your device. Now this could enhance your actual experience with a Fire Stick TV or 4K, and also gaming, and also just media playback. It doesn't come with a lot of storage, only comes with eight gig, and the RAM is only a couple of gig. Processor is a 1.7 gigahertz processor, so all in all, it's not too bad. Unless you start cramming loads of stuff on there, then your whole user experience is just gonna slow down massively. So today, we're just gonna clean the hell out of your Fire Stick. We're gonna do a deep clean, we are gonna do a spring clean, and we're gonna get it working and optimizing it so much better, so your whole experience is a lot better as well. So anyway, let's start the five minute countdown and get on with the video. Thanks very much. Right, guys, this is obviously the home screen of your Amazon 4K Fire Stick. And what we wanna do is go over to an application called FileLinked. If you don't already have it, just let me know and I will do a further guide and also do a blog post either at cssCoder.com. So what FileLinked does is turn codes into URLs and those URLs become stores from our favorite content creators that give us loads of applications uh, for free that are readily to download. So the number that we wanna stick in here right now is ready just all the nines and hit on next, okay? Once we've done that, we can hit on continue. Now this is Tech Doctor UK, the legend, that is, it's his file link store and in here is just so much good stuff. Now if he does ask for a further pin, it's super simple, just go over to the URL provided where it says and just get a pin. And the pin does change, so I'm not even gonna tell you it uh, because it will be pointless because it will be different and it's randomly generated. So this is the one we want to go for, DBTV Assistant. So all we need to do is just click on that and then it's gonna start download. Once that's downloaded, we're gonna click on the uh, Fire Stick remote again and we're gonna say, please install it. So we're gonna go down and go to install. I will add that have a look through the store because it is absolutely fantastic of all the stuff you will ever need. Now we're just gonna click on the hamburger menu. This is gonna actually open the application, but we can still get it from our home screen if we want. So as you can see, TV cleaner 85, boom, let's start straight. Great user interface, and it's going through all of the uh, all the space that they can get rid of, and there we go, it's got rid of some already. Now we can actually go into uninstall, and this is a one-click uninstall. So I don't use Twitch, so do you want to uninstall this app? Yes, please. Cleaning up. And so it doesn't just uninstall it, it then recleans it afterwards. C Cleaner, do we want that? No, we don't want that. So we're gonna uninstall that as well. Uninstall complete and then clean afterwards again. What else have we got? We've got Cat Mouse, File Links, BBC iPlayer. I'm never gonna watch that on my Fire Stick up here. So I'm gonna get rid of that as well. So once that's done, we can just go back and do a, I like to do another little run to get rid of absolutely anything else. So anything in the memory, anything obsolete, anything that we don't need. So it also has a network test. I'm not gonna show you my awful speeds because they are absolutely disgusting upstairs. And you've also got auto auto run um, killer as well. So this is obviously auto running once you actually uh, start the Amazon Fire TV stick. And But obviously you can see it needs root permission. So you don't really need that. The whole reason why we're doing this video is to clean up your device. You can go onto your device inf info and you can see 1.6 gigahertz, RAM 1.26 gig, and with an internal storage of 8.35 gig. So you need to keep that internal storage, you know, free as much as you can. Now, if you didn't realize that when you actually install an application, it kind of leaves over loads like the install package and everything behind, stuff that you don't need actually wants to run your application, whatever that may be that you've downloaded. So this cleaner will just get rid of absolutely everything. I just like the uninstall feature that will massively help your device and just make it so, so much more better. Much more better? It's not even proper English. Um, I don't know whether they've spelled uh, available wrong up there, but available does not have a C in it. So 58% storage available. So we just do one more little clean. There we go. 
can be clean, residual and clearing the cache and there we go, done. So if you were going to play games, I would recommend doing this prior to actually playing it or even streaming anything as well or even something as simple as watching Netflix. Give this a good little clean prior to using that, then you'll be good to go. Did we make it within the five minutes? Hell yes. Hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you on the next one.